Good day, this is Coach Paul Eugene, and I am back with another exciting workout. Well, today I am here on the floor, and we're gonna work our abs, our hips, and our thighs. You'll love that. So, if you're on the floor at home, you may wanna put a towel or maybe a yoga mat or fitness mat on the floor, okay? Now, with that said, let's get started with our first exercise. Well, the first exercise today is gonna to require us to come up on our knees and our hands. It's called the hydrant. Now, our arms are not locked, they're loose. So all we're gonna do is lift the leg up and bring it back down. I like to say that I'm sweeping some crumbs off the floor. Ready? Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, you got it, two, one, again, eight, seven, oh yeah, six, five, and four, and three, and two, and one, one more set, last eight, oh yeah, seven, six, and five, four, and three, and two, and one, hold here. Now, how was that? Now here's what I want to do. Make sure your toes are into your floor and you wanna sit back on your heels if you can and take these arms out front. We're gonna go into a stretch. Hold it, right here, for four, three, and two, and one. Come up, good job. Now I'm gonna turn my body the other direction because we're gonna work the other leg. Now, here's a tip. During this workout here, I want you to keep your core tugged in tight, okay? Now, are you ready? Three sets of eight, <clears throat> everybody. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, and two, and one, second set. Eight, oh yeah, seven, six, five, four, oh yeah, three, two, and one, last set. Eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, and two, last one. Hold it right here. Now, flatten your toes out. Sit back on your heels if you can. If not, that's fine. Stretch out your arms, let's stretch it out. For four, three, and two, and one. Come up. Now, we're gonna do another floor exercise for our hips. I'm turning on this side. I like to start on this side first. Now this one is gonna require us to come down on our elbows. I'm gonna call this my um, donkey kick. We're gonna press the foot up, raise it up, bring it back in. It's this movement, just like that. You got the picture? Hold that core in. Everybody, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Again, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Last set of eight. Eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, and two, and one. 
hold here. Now, we're gonna stretch it out again. So, your feet are pointed into the floor. Sit back and hold the stretch right here. For four, three, two, and one. Come up. Now, I'm gonna turn my body because we're gonna work the other side. How you doing out there? Are you loving this? I am old school. Down on those elbows. <clears throat> yes. Ready? Kick the donkey. Eight. Seven. Six. We got it. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Again. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold here. Sit back on those heels. Let's stretch it out for four, three, and two, and one. Come up. Good job. Now, how did you do? <laughs> now, from here, I want to take us straight into a plank. Yep. Now I'm going to turn this way. I'm going to give you a couple options. You can take your plank up high, like this. Watch the alignment of your body. You don't want your butt up here, right here. Or you can do the standard plank, elbows, legs out, and watch that alignment again. That's the move, okay? Now, here's a picture. I'm gonna challenge you and me <coughs> to a 30 second plank. You can do it, right? Now you choose your position. I'm gonna go up high, because I love taking my plank up high. I'm gonna come up on my toes, <coughs> keep my body alignment, and I'm gonna count it down, ready? Here it is, 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, hang in there, 3, Two and one. Lower knees down. Good job. Now let's sit back for a stretch. Oh yeah. For four and three and two and one. Good job. Come up. Now, how did you do on that plank? <laughs> you know I me. Mean? I'm turning the body around because I'm going to do the plank again from this view. But this time, I'm gonna do a different position. I'm bring my elbows down, and I'm gonna extend my legs back, engaging my core, no butt up in the air, but just like this. That's the movement. And four, three, two, let's go. 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, hang in there, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Lower knees down. Good job. Come back. Let's stretch it out. Oh yeah, that felt so good. For four, three, and two, and one. Come up. Ah, let's turn the other direction. Now you know what's on my mind. It's a modified upward dog. Yes, we'll be right here. Now all we're gonna do, tuck our toes under, and you're gonna come up 
into a modified move right here. Downward dog. Now, you can have it bent in your knees if you don't have that flexibility, but we're gonna hold it right here for four, three, two, and one. Now, I'm gonna take my foot pressing in and out right here. Follow me. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one. Hold here. Now lower the knees down. Yes. Now sit back, stretch it out. <clears throat> and hold for four, three, and two, and one. Good job. Come up. Woohoo! How was that? Now I'm going to turn the other way. You know why? Because <laughs> we're going to do that upward dog, downward dog modified. I tuck my toes under and I push up on my toes. And I'm right here. Yes. I call this modified because we're not doing a super, super upward dog. Hip up. Let's press those feet. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one. Hold here. Now lower those legs down. Good job. Flatten out your feet. Sit back for a stretch. For four, three, and two, and one. Come up. Ah, how did you do? Now let's turn around this way. Now you know what's on Coach Paul Eugene's mind right now. <laughs> You'll be surprised. It's called push-ups. Yes. Now, I'm going to give you an opportunity. You can do modified push-ups. Yes. We're only going to do 10, so don't worry. So, the modified is this. Legs going to be crossed. Right here. And all you want to do is come down. And up. Right there. Now, if you want to work more of the chest, you can, in shoulders, you can take a wider stance and come down right here and up. It's your choice. But keep those legs crossed. You ready? Count down. Four, three, everybody, let's go. 10, up, nine, up, eight, Seven. Up. You got it. Come on. Six. Up. Five. Up. Four. Up. Three. Up. Two. Up. One more. Good job. Uncross the legs. Let's sit back for stretch right here. Excellent. Hold here for four, three, two, and one. Good job. Come up. Ah, how did you do? Now, tell me, do you think you have it in you to do one more set of 10? Yes, you can modify it. You don't have to do military. You can take a wide grip or the close grip, okay? Now, let's get going. On this set, I'm gonna do a wider grip, okay? So my hands and arms are out wider. They're not very close to my body. And here I got my legs crossed. Ready, go down, 10. Nine, up, eight, up, seven,
seven, up, six, up, five, it feels so good, up, oh yeah, four, up, three, up, just two more, two, up, last one, we can do it, push it up, good job, uncross the legs, bring it a little bit, sit back and stretch it out, hold here, for four, three, and two, and one, good job, come up, ah, now, how did you do, now, the next set of exercises is going to require us to be on our back. Yes, you'll love that. So we're gonna do bridges, we're gonna do some crunches, some bicycle, perhaps some leg lifts. So, everybody, we're gonna reposition our bodies by coming down on our backs. I just had to move my mic, mic a little bit. So what we're gonna do is come down right here onto our back. Oh yes, I love this. So the first move is gonna be the bridge. Now, on the bridge, you're basically gonna be lifting your hips off the floor. It's gonna involve the quads and it helps the lower back. So we're just gonna lift up, lower back down, right there. You don't have to get deep with this. So in four, Three, get ready. <coughs> Two, one. I go up, lower down. Seven, lower down. Six, lower down. Five, lower down. Four, lower down. Three, lower down. You got it. Two, lower down, and one, hold the bridge right here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, lower down. Yes. Now I want you to bring your legs in. Grab your legs with your hands, not your knees. Let's stretch it out for four, and three, and two, and one. Now lower the feet down. Excellent. Now, we're gonna do the same bridge on the other side. So, I'm just gonna roll over this way and come up. I'm over here now. Now I'm gonna take that seat right here. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna lay back and so are you. Are you ready? Bridge lift. Here we go up. Eight. And down. Seven. And down. Six. And down. Five. And down. Good job. Four. And down. Three. And down. Two and down and last one hold it up there hold it hold it hold it for eight seven six five four three two and lower yes now bring those knees in grab the legs around your below your knees hold stretch for eight seven six five and four, and three, and two, and one. Good job. Lower the feet down. Now, right from this position here, on this side, we're gonna do those famous, famous bicycles. And you're gonna love that, right? <laughs> I just set up for a second. Now, I'm gonna go back down. 
And all that bicycle is, you can have your hands behind your head, and all we're gonna do is press out and in. That's the move. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, I'm not in a hurry. Three, two, one. Again, give me eight, seven, six, five, just relax. Four, three, and two, and one. Bring that leg in, lower the feet down. Ah, and how did you do? Now, while we're here, we might as well just jump right into crunches. <laughs> I love it. Simple crunches. You don't have to lift up high. And four, three, two, we go. Eight, seven, six, five, <clears throat> four, three, two, one, again, last eight, seven, keep going, six, and five, four, three, and two, and one, hold here, good job. Now from here, just take this leg here, cross it over, ah, we're going to take this elbow right here, and all we're going to do is crunch up and crunch down. Ready? Let's go. Eight, seven, you can have this on out here. Six, five, four, don't worry about. Three, reaching that knee. Two, one, eight more. Last eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, and two, and one. Hold here, uncross it. Bring those legs in, hold for a stretch, right here. For four, and three, and two, and one. Okay, lower the feet down. Now let's take this leg here, cross it over. We're gonna crunch up, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Again, last eight, seven, six, five. How you doing? Four, three, and two. And one, hold here. Now uncross that leg, excellent. Pull those legs in, hold your legs right here. For four, I'm turning my feet. Three, and two, and one. Lower the feet down, excellent. Now I'm just gonna roll up right here. Now, how did we do? Well, we're not done. I just want to turn on the, this side here. Now what I'm going to do is have us do some leg work, but I have to move my mic out of the way because I don't want to roll on to the mic. <laughs> Forgive me as I do my little maintenance. Okay, I got it loose. So from here, I want you to lay here on your side. Yes, see how my legs are like this? And I'm gonna come on my elbow. And all I'm gonna do is take this leg out, hand here for support, raise it up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Give me four more, yes. Three more, yes, 
two more. Yes. And one. And bring it down. Now bring that leg on top of the other leg. Now we're gonna work that hip. What we're gonna do is cross this leg over right here, like we're stretching out that hip. And all we're gonna do is send the leg back and bring it down again. That's the movement. Bring it down, across, extend it out. Bring it down, across, extend it out. Bring it down, across, extend it out. Give me four more. Yes. Three more. Yes. Two more. Yes. And last one, hold it right here. Stretching out that hip for four. Three, how did you do? Two and one. Good job. Now bring that leg up here. Let's roll over onto our back. Yes. <laughs> because we're gonna switch around. So roll up and switch around. Excellent. Now this side, I'll get my mic out the way. So we're here, right? Can we take a nap right now? I think we can. Now you can come here, legs across, extend this leg out, Ready, raise it up. Eight, down. Seven, down. Six, down. I'm going to sleep. Five, <laughs> down. Four, down. Three, down. Two, down. And last one, bring it down. Now, bring it in alignment with the other leg on top. Legs across. Now bring it across like you're stretching out that hip for four, three, and two. Part two, we extend it back. Extend it back, bring it down. Seven, bring it down. Six. Bring it down. Five. Bring it down. Four. Bring it down. Three. Bring it down. Two. Bring it down. And one more. Bring it down and hold here. Stretching out that hip. For four. Three. Two. And one, good job. Now, take those legs right here, and I want everyone to roll onto your back. <laughs> yes. And we're gonna do a full body stretch. So, extend the legs out and out. Now, take your arms up and over. Full body stretch for eight, seven, relaxing, six, Five, four, three, and two, and one. Good job. Now bring those arms up. Now bring the legs up right here. Yes. I don't want you to turn these legs facing me. All right, and now look back over your shoulder. We're stretching out right here for four, three, two, and one. Now bring those legs back up. Let's turn the other side. Turn those legs out. Now, look towards me. Yes. Feel the stretch. For four, <coughs> three, <coughs> two, and one. Bring them back up. Good job. Now from here, I want everybody to roll up right here. Now from here, we can turn around facing me. 
how you doing? Our legs are cross, <laughs> you know, but I don't want to stay right here. So what we're going to do is bring the soles of our feet together. And we're going to what? Stretch it out right here for four, pressing down, three, two, one, again, and four, three, how you doing? And two, and one, again, press it down for four, and three, and two, and one, release it. Ah, how does that feel? Now from here, do what you can do. Take this leg out. Now, bring this leg in alongside there. Now, if you can hold that toe, hold it right there. If you can only do this, then do this, all right? Now, let's hold it for four, three, two, one, again. For four, three, two, and one. Good job. Come up. Now, take this leg out that way. Bring this one in, alongside there, and the thigh. Now again, if you can hold here, that's fine. If you only can hold here, then hold here. Ready? Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, stretching out, four, three, and two, and one, good job, come up. How did you do? You did good. Now, for good measure, let's turn this way, right here. And all we're gonna do is do a stretch, like this. Now, I want you to inhale up, exhale, go over. If you can grab your toes, grab them. If not, you can stay right here for eight, seven, Six, five, four, you got it. Three, and two, and one. Release. Good job. Now, turn back to the front. Yes. Let's cross those legs. Right here. Excellent. I'm looking at you. You're looking at me. Sitting up tall. Relaxing your body. Now, I want you to take a nice inhale up with me. Exhale. <sighs> inhale again. Palms together. Now bring your hands down in front of your chest, your heart. Yes, good job. I'd like to thank you for joining me today for this floor work. I had a fun time. I trust that I have inspired and encouraged some of you to Get back on the floor again. It was such a, a good time. Now take these hands straight up. Bring them out to the side. Contract your abs. Bring your arms around you. Give yourself a nice hug. You did a fantastic job. Well, this is Coach Paul Eugene. That is great grandpa Paul Eugene. On the floor, inspiring you and encouraging you to exercise and stretch your body, your soul, and your spirit. Unwrap yourself, hands right here, resting on your legs here, and guess what? I want you to rehydrate your body by drinking plenty of water, yes. And I want you to go on about today being blessed and your spirit, and your soul, and your body. And I pray that the peace, the love, and the hope, and the joy of God Almighty may touch you. Everybody, go forth in this awesome day. I'll see you next time.